What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, your boy Diddy came out, and he had some things to say about this whole uh, issue debacle with Cassie. Let's 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 hear him out. On the darkest times in your life, sometimes you got to do that. He said he don't want. Sometimes you got to reflect on the darkest times of your life, but you don't want to do that. I was. Up. Uh. I mean, I hit rock bottom, mm. but I make no excuses. Mm. My behavior on that video is yeah. inexcusable. Facts. I take full responsibility. For no, you don't. First of all, this chocolate, unattained, uncontrollable, rich, actually came out and said Cassie was lying. If y'all don't recollect, because I do. She lying. This ain't nothing but a money grab. Niggas just want money. Then the next day, boom, it disappears. He gives her 30 million. No problem. But he called her a liar. For my ashes and this was a couple months ago. You have not changed. That video. <laughs> I'm disgusted. I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. Too. I had to go into therapy, and go into rehab. Had to ask God for his mercy and grace. Ooh. This nigga should have horns coming from his head. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But I'm committed to be a better man each and every day. I'm not asking for forgiveness. You ain't got it anyway. I'm truly sorry. Nobody believes you but them niggas that done hit right after they done. I'm sorry, man. You made me do it. You're a grown ass man. You grabbed that damn girl from the back of her head and tossed her down like she was a piece of Alabama trash. Okay? The sh that she went through before, though, you got in that hallway is the sh that we pissed off about as well. This nigga came out and said she was lying. This nigga came out and said that the other girl was lying who said that she was he was kicking her in her stomach when she was pregnant. Y'all know that's definitely true at this point. I'm still going to say allegedly. But um, I'm going to just say this. He could have saved this little piece of sh video. Out there at one of his mansions somewhere. You could have saved that. Uh-uh. That should have stayed in his camera roll. Because I'm going to tell y'all this right now. This nigga ain't nothing. And then they say he has to do, um, not he has to do, but the LAPD or whoever PD said that it's a statute of limitation on this video and they can't do shit about it. He know that. That's why he coming out like, my fault. <laughs> I know I still got to deal with y'all. Y'all still got to deal with me. I ain't mean to. Get the f off my phone. I don't know about y'all, but I wouldn't believe nothing this nigga ever said for the rest of his life. I don't ever want to listen to his music again. Right now, I'm questioning Tupac and Biggie. And I know a lot of y'all have been questioning it too, but let's go into Kim Porter. J-Lo, were you in any of these situations? Because it seems he didn't put his hands on you. Um, You know what I'm saying? Now I'm questioning my whole childhood and shit. All right, y'all, let's get into Dre, girl. He back and I lost his mind again. And and my brother did Krishan bad. He that's, that's, that's probably his biggest enemy right now is Krishan on the low. Ain't everybody surprised, right? But yeah, on the low, yeah, my brother is, is, is his biggest enemy right now is probably Krishan. And now all of a sudden she best friends with his manager, Wack. That's that's even more scary with me. Um, you know, my brother done done so much wrong to her. He didn't he done robbed her of over three hundred thousand dollars when they shot the show. Uh he only gave her a little bit because I guess he felt like he was the bigger star. Um he he went and got her baby and, and then come to find out she found out that he knows that's not his baby. Um <laughs> He's they they've had a very tumultuous relationship and I I I feel like it's turned into Dre spell tumultuous spell it I I dare you <laughs> uh, um uh um I can't spell it either but I know he can't spell it just something more toxic than we realized but I know she hates his guts and she's faking and 
and and that's probably his biggest enemy right now is is probably her you know what i'm saying because nobody else probably hates him more um and and my brother did Krishan bad he that's 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 probably hold on let me go to uh got the scoop got got dot the scoop okay my brother supposedly may or may not. He, I think they saying he was attacked again. Hopefully he wasn't. I don't know. I think, um, please I just don't pray know. for him. Um, but you know what I'm saying? Nobody talking about it is what's scaring me. Um, now remember I made that post and all of a sudden he just, he keep getting attacked. You know what I'm saying? So, um, I don't know. I'm, I don't know what's going on. Uh, Dre got the driest mouth in the world. I, his mouth really worries me. Uh, nobody's really saying nothing. Um, <sighs> You know, please just pray for him. Um, like I said, you know, uh, uh, um, just let's just please pray for him. You know, that, that, if, if, that God could change his heart. And then if, if his heart is changed, that he could be saved. Uh, but yeah, they saying he was attacked again and nobody's saying nothing again, um, which is crazy. Um, a lot of people say they love him. You know, his dad over there, uh, but his dad probably is, is, is over there sick of him. Uh, Krishan over there on the low really hates him. How can he be sick of him? He ain't even there. You know, hates his guts, you know, more than anybody. Uh, Krishan probably love him more than anybody. Krishan probably love him more than you. <laughs> uh, you know, I, she said she had people in there supposed to be looking out for him, but ain't nobody looking out for him because he, he, he in there by himself. You know what I'm saying? Because he did the crime. He the one who got to do the time, Dre. And, um, and if getting him looked out for, how, where where is his, how does he keep getting messed up? If, if you supposed to be having people look out for him in there, you said you got people on the inside, you know what I'm saying? Where, where is his people at this, that, that you was talking about that, that your friend told me that you was talking to people in there and they're supposed to be having his back. Where, where is they having his back or not? Um, you know, uh, uh, um, no. it's, <laughs> you, my little brother's dad, uh, you, you're a very slimy human being. You know what I'm saying? You've already robbed him once of 92,000 and, and, and you, you don't care probably about robbing him again. You, you hate your son. I, I recently found that out that yeah, you you hate your son. You have two. No, he probably just love money, just like Blueface, and he's a terrible nigga for stealing from Blueface. But I don't know why Blueface would let him back in his house after he has stolen from him. That is a question that I do have. However, he did let him back in his house because he ain't over there by default. Blueface had him over there before he even went to prison because he knew he was gonna need him to watch his house, which in fact. Blueface probably told that nigga for the money you stole from me, I'ma use you to watch my damn house, okay? And he there to patrol Krishan. Let's talk about it, all right? So yeah, Dre just always missing facts, always. Two people who, who, who you have one person without a backbone and another person who hates my brother, oh. and and they just in the house all day. That that don't sound like it. Now they best friends too. Uh, my brother supposedly may or may not. He, I think they saying he was attacked again. Hopefully he was. may or may not. I think and all this other stuff, bro. <clears throat> your boy is going through it. First of all, let's just be very clear. We all going through it. I ain't gonna lie. Right now, this is a show of humans. Do you hear me? And the ones that are able to maintain and still like work out and eat healthy is a blessing. <laughs> but. Girl, some of us rather eat a Twinkie or have a um a cigarette all day long because it with a shot of Hennessy. Cause this place is crazy, okay? But with that being said, like all jokes aside, his brother, I don't know what's going on with him. And granted, Blueface might have gotten into a fight, a squabble in jail he's in jail you know what i'm saying so it is a huge possibility for him to get into it with somebody um but you know we don't know if that happened or not i can we can never go off dre's word so <clears throat> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below um i wanted to add that to this video i'm done with it love y'all appreciate y'all hell yeah